Hey, 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 this is your friendly neighborhood sales guy, Dev Garvi. Thank you for tuning in. Today's topic is the most important talk here, topic of the day. Um, have you had situation where you walked into some showroom or, or you're trying to buy something and you don't like the sales guy? Um, that, that guy was not motivated enough, was not interested enough, he was not uh, you know, happy or chirpy enough. You got some vibes from that person. Uh, either the person was so dead or he was negative, he was you know, uninterested. You know, we, we all face this challenge every time, every day in life when we're dealing with people, right? People are not charged up, they're not happy, they're not enthusiastic. So today's topic is having an attitude worth millions, right? Millions of dollars. You know, attitude or service is superior to your product or service. Like if I'm looking to buy a product or service, I can buy that product from all different stores, from different vendors. There are multiple options that I have. But if I have, why do I go to a place uh, very often? You know, probably more than the product or service you like. I mean, more than the product you like, the person's service, the positive attitude, the energy, the enthusiasm, the person who serves you very often, and you have long-term relationship in, in that with that vendor is because of his service, right? Service includes. The attitude, the killer attitude, you know, is the person willing to understand me, right? If the person knows what I want, the kind of quality I expect out of the person, right? So we don't mind paying extra for the good service as compared to good product with bad service, right? It's important, right? You would not mind to pay extra, you know, be it the extra tips or extra money just because you like the person or you like that person's service as compared to the product which may be superior in quality but may not be as great as the first person's service, right? People will always buy, all right? So historically, we all know, right? There's only certain amount that we spend on our needs and the large amount we spend on things that makes us happy. Why is that? Because human beings, we all want to feel good, right? Would you not want a person who makes you feel good? All right, so coming to the topic, which is the attitude superior than the product or service that you have, that you offer. How can you stay motivated, you know, stay active, stay charged up, uh, you know, all day, right? There, there are a few things which I do, which I tell my team to do on a daily basis is first and foremost, understand what, what would make uh, the other person happy, right? What would make the person happy is somebody who was chirpy, who was excited enough for the job, who was enjoying the life. That is the first thing. You need to get charged up. Watch the motivational videos, all right? Listen or talk to people who are really, really high on enthusiasm, who are very positive. Avoid the negative vibes or negative people. That's the first and foremost thing you need to do. Whether you're in sales or service, whatever you're doing, that's the first thing, right? It doesn't matter what you say unless you say it with the passion, with the conviction. And the passion and conviction will only come when you have a killer attitude, you have will to help the customer, right? Number two, which I tell my uh, you know, uh, team is, you need to really, really understand and believe that whatever product or services that you are offering is really superior and it's really going to add value to the customer, right? So these are two things which I tell my team. So the moment you get on the phone, you know, Forget your life, everything. You have to be 100% committed to the customer. You need to be 100% charged, 100% excited. And then that's the only time when you will build the good, you know, rapport with the customer. Uh, and then the chances of you closing that person is really good. So uh, whenever my customer says, hey, you know what? I can buy the same product or services somewhere else. That's fine, right? But I know for sure that they will not get me along with the deal. And I'm the one who makes the difference, difference, right? I am the one who serves him well. I'm the one who's committed to serve him, right? So these are the things which I articulate to my customer. And I have done that. I've done, you know, some live, you know, calls I've shared on the last uh, videos. You can listen to them. Uh, I will do more videos where, you know, I always get, I try, at least I try to stay 100% committed and excited whenever I'm dealing with the customers. All right. So call to action. Be jacked up. Be charged up. Look and Find a way to stay motivated, stay excited, stay energetic, you know, instead of having an opening 
hey, this is XYZ from uh, you know, XYZ company. Um, thank you for your time. No, no, no. You need to take that five notch up, right? Hey, this is Dave here from XYZ company. How are you today? I am fantastic, right? People would want to love to talk to people who are excited and positive, right? I'm sure you want to stay away from negative people, right? You always try and stay away from people who always cry in crib. So similarly, same thing applies to your role, your job. Your job is not to sell a product, but you're selling your personality, right? Remember, you're selling your personality and people will pay more for your personality than they'll pay for your product and services. All right, so be great, be fantastic. Do tune in into LinkedIn, YouTube. Uh, you know, you, there are different ways to stay motivated. But if you have to do only one and only thing, which I have to tell you, just follow me, right? I'm on a mission to help 10 million people in coming years. And I'm committed to my goal. I am excited about my goal. I write down my goal every day. That is what you are supposed to do as well. Write down your goals every day. Stay excited. Believe in that goal and just go for it. All right. With that thought, this is Dave Gudvi. Uh, hope you like the video and feel free to share if you like it. Leave a comment. If you have any question, do reach out to me. Uh, I'm trying to help you know whoever I can. Uh, again, I'm not in this for money. Uh, it just really makes me happy. All right. So stay, stay good. Stay fantastic. Signing off. Dave Gudvi.